Welcome to ChilloPro.net. My name is Paul Fleury, and today I'm going to show you the definition of volume on the instrument. There are three things that cause a difference in volume on the instrument without mechanically changing the sound, i.e., put a mute on the bridge. Okay, the first one is, most obviously, pressure of the bow. Very light pressure. I'm almost lifting the bow off of the string with my first finger in my bow by giving more muscle and digging in. We hit <coughs> loudness. We can vary this in a single bow movement. That's the first thing that causes volume. The second thing is speed of the bow. You move the bow slow with its X amount of pressure. You get a volume. Move the bow twice as fast, same amount of pressure. Same amount of pressure. Faster bow movement, you get fortissimo. So, the second thing that causes volume is speed of the bow. Third and most ambiguous one is vibrato. Same pressure with the bow, same speed. Notice the slight fluctuation in the volume there. The reason why is when you examine the sine wave of the pitch, which is a G that's being played, the vibrato that I'm causing is causing a counterfluctuation in the sine wave, actually projecting the tone more towards the ear. We know that sound waves move like ripples across a pond. Therefore, all we need to do is make the ripples go faster, they'll go further, and it will seem like there's more volume. You're actually projecting more volume to the ear listener, the human ear. Thank you very much. I'll see you in the next video.